your Sunseeker Fat Tad electric trike, uh, we set the X seam measurement like so from the back of the seat to the front of the pedal. You can see here we've got a 42 inch X seam. Uh, we also, uh, the inseam will be set from the front of the seat to the pedal and generally with the inseam we'll subtract two to three inches from the measurement. So if you had a 33 inch inseam, we'd set your uh, front of the seat to pedal measurement at about 31 inches like this. Uh, if you need to adjust this, the clamping screws are on the bottom of the boom tube here. They use a five millimeter Allen wrench and uh, you just loosen up those two screws. When you start adjusting this, you need to be very mindful of the two cables that run on the underside of the boom. One's a mechanical cable for the front derailleur here, and one is an electrical cable for the pedal assist sensor there. If you're pulling the boom out a lot or pushing it in a lot, it's going to uh, it's going to affect these cables. If you pull it out, it's going to tighten up this cable and you can damage it if you yank on it hard. So if you need to extend it, you've got to follow the cable back and find some more slack where you can pull the cable through some of its runs. If you go all the way back, you can find its bundle and uh, loosen it up some that way. The derailleur cable, as it tightens up, it can change the tension on the derailleur, so you may need to adjust it to get your shifting right. But once you've got that loosened up, you can sort of twist and wiggle and pull the boom out or push it in. And then when you've got it set, you can level it out so that the cranks are nice and level to the ground. And then you can tighten the screws back up. Take your measurement, the same two X seam and in seam measurements we started with, and double check them. And then see where we've ended up. So you can see here we've added about a half inch uh, just for fun. You'll have to dial this into your personal preference and you know details of what kind of shoes you've got and that kind of thing as you go. So it's normal to adjust this. The second place you can make an adjustment is the seat. You can see there's three spots for the seat and uh, you can move the seat by undoing this bolt and moving it to one of the other two holes and dropping the seat knuckle onto the bolt and that gives you some more adjustability for the seat as well. With this, you'll want to look out for these cables up here and make sure that you're not snagging those and that you're giving them slack as you need them. After you do the boom, if you've made a large adjustment to the boom, more than about an inch or so, you'll need to check out your chain tension and your derailleur adjustment and we'll go over those in a separate video.